msu.edu, or you can call the MSU hotline at 1-888-678-3464. And what you should do is stay tuned for Ike Engelbaum with the Bright Side of Aging and the Entrepreneur's Network Show. That's coming up next. Have a wonderful day. Thank you for sharing the morning. I'm Bob Allison. Rob and I will see you tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock. This is WNZK, Dearborn Heights, Detroit. Your ethnic superstation at 690 days, 680 nights. WNZK has available a few good hours of airtime for a few good programs to serve their communities. Radio is better than ever in targeting an audience that listens to what you say. Learn more about this exciting radio broadcasting opportunity by calling WNZK Radio at 248-557-3500. Welcome to the Bright Side of Aging. My name is Ike Engelbaum. I'm a pharmacist and the publisher of AmericanSeniorGazette.org. It has been wisely said, you cannot help getting older, but you can help getting old. It has also been said that age is a matter of the mind. If you don't mind, it doesn't matter. My purpose in doing the show is so that seniors and caregivers can share their ideas and questions on how we can age gracefully and in a vertical position for as long as our good genes will allow. And if we've inherited bad genes, how to outwit them. Our topics include senior housing, financial, legal, safety, travel, health issues, interesting senior events in the community, and most of all, tips on how to put old on hold. His house calls on wheels. And uh, if you need a helping hand to stay at home, or maybe you'd like somebody to provide transportation or grocery shopping, or run errands for you, uh, or maybe you're going to need help with bathing or personal grooming, or you need home renovations to enable you to stay in that home safely and securely. Or maybe you can't leave your home, but you need somebody to come in and do things like a doctor, a nurse, a podiatrist, a dentist, or uh, to have your prescriptions delivered to you. Well, house calls on wheels is the answer to all of that. House Calls on Wheels provides both medical and non-medical services in your home. And all the medical services are covered by insurance. The non-medical services start as low as $10 an hour. So if you or someone you know needs a helping hand at home, call House Calls on Wheels for a free in-home consultation. And that toll-free number is 1-888-489-8980. All right? That's 1-888-489-8980. Tune in every Wednesday at 11 a.m. for the Bright Side of Aging and the Entrepreneur's Network radio show featuring Ike Engelbaum. Ike does an array of interviews with people that make the aging process go smoothly. And for the Entrepreneurs Network segment, Ike interviews up-and-coming entrepreneurs. If you're looking to start your own business, Ike has some great advice to offer you to get your dreams of starting a home-based business a reality. If you'd like to talk to Ike Engelbaum for more information, call 313-929-6105. That's 313-929-6105. So tune in every Wednesday at 11 a.m. to hear Ike Engelbaum on the Bright Side of Aging and the Entrepreneur Network radio show. And we're on, and hopefully you're on <laughs> with an umbrella. I did not think we'd need an umbrella for snow. At this. It's spring. <laughs> Would someone please tell the weatherman? <laughs> weatherman, weatherman, where, where are you? Anyway... Uh, the good news is is that at this time of the year, uh, if you think optimistically, which 
I like to promote since it's titled The Bright Side of Aging. And in fact, uh, if you share in optimism and all, you're welcome to join me uh, for the Optimist Club breakfast every Tuesday morning from 7.30 to 8.30 at the Stage Deli, which is right on Orchard Lake Road, south of Maple. And uh, we uh, surround ourselves with people who look at uh, the snowing as a solid sunshine. <laughs> and I don't expect you to uh, necessarily enjoy uh, these uh, quick switches, but at least adjust to them. And the uh, mission that I uh, have adapted for The Bright Side of Aging is uh, a uh, ABC's approach. A is accept and adjust as to what's going on. Uh, everyone always is worried about how old they are. Truth is that aging is inevitable, but wisdom is optional. And as long as you have the attitude that things are not going to be quite the same as when you were younger as far as age, uh, which stands for agility, uh, then uh, you accept what's going on, adjust. Uh, famous George Burns line that I use quite often is, I'm getting to that point in life now that when I bend down, I see what else I can do while I'm down there. <laughs> And uh, it seems like I'm doing more adjusting. I love to play tennis. Uh, and although the nets are up on a lot of public uh, courts, it's not exactly a tennis-type day. But it's coming. And I notice in my tennis game in my younger years, I was able to sort of retrieve almost any shot within reason, of course. And... Uh, it was a great joy to be able to hit the ball back when everybody thought that it was a finishing point uh, for my opponent. And uh, fortunately, I was able to scramble quickly enough and return a lot of shots that made you feel good. Now, as I've aged a bit, or seasoned as I like to call it, I say nice shot much more often. <laughs> and uh, my opponents get a tick out of it and all. Uh, and then you balance your life because it's very, very important as you age to realize that unfortunately people closest in your life are not going to be around forever. And uh, some unfortunately pass away much earlier than they should. And suddenly there's a hole in your social calendar of people that you always enjoy getting together with that are no longer around. There's no way that you can replace certain friendships and relationships, obviously. But there is a way that you can balance it by, you know, introducing yourself to new groups and all. That's why I strongly encourage you whether you're uh, religious, of course, if you are religious, House of Faith is a great way of getting to know people that are like-minded and have a belief system. But if you're not religious, there's all kinds of organizations of people that share in a common view. Don't, you know, become a recluse. Worst thing in the world as you age is to avoid company because you don't have that special significant other person in your life with you. I am sure if there is a way that uh, could be communicated that I'm sure the people that you miss because they're passed on uh, probably would feel better knowing that you are still enjoying life. So uh, don't look upon it as somehow you're achieving anything more by mourning for the rest of your living life of someone who's gone. And C, of course, is have the connections. Stay connected. We can do it by radio. You can do it by joining us for our Entrepreneur Network coffee clashes or coffee connection. We meet every Thursday morning from 9.15 to 10.30 at Level 1 Bank. If you're uh, retired, I always encourage people to say they are refired, not retired. 
Uh, level one bank is at 37100 Woodward, southeast corner of Big Beaver and Woodward on Thursdays. So come on by, free donuts, free coffee. Get a chance to talk to people who many times have decided that they're not making the kind of money that they thought they would uh, once they retired with Social Security and their uh, the interest on their investments, you can start your own business or uh, actually uh, get uh, connections with people that need your expertise. That's what you have to sell. If you're interested, call our toll-free number, 888-489-8980. 888-489-8980. I welcome any call if I can make a positive difference in your life. And one person that I am really uh, joyful that I have in my life is Dr. Andre Lee. Dr. Andre Lee has uh, got all kinds of degrees, uh, DPA, MPA, FACHE. He's a graduate of Michigan State University and Cornell University and also Nova SC University. Southeast. Uh, Southeast. <laughs> Southeast. All right. All right. Okay, why don't we say Southeast University? Now you're, now you're down in the South, and Dr. Lee is in Tennessee. How about that? Is that correct, Dr. Lee? Yes, sir. <laughs> and just to, just to stick that needle in a little bit, uh, it was 84 degrees down there yesterday. Uh, that, you, that's a whole bunch <laughs> of sticking, man. <laughs> Stop with the sticking, okay? <laughs> I can't help it. I can't help it. <laughs> but uh, you are. Hey, congr but, but, uh, yes, sir. I, yeah. but congratulations to Michigan, the University of Michigan basketball team. They yeah. they did a marvelous job. Uh -huh, there you go. That yeah. uh, that's an yeah. added incentive for you to come back and visit. All right. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm coming. Now that the snow has stopped, I'm on my way. I, I will be up there soon. All right. Well, uh, look forward to our getting together. And mm -hmm. uh, you've always got some interesting factoids. I thought I'd impress you with that word. Uh, is there something you want to share with us today, Dr. Lee? Well, you know, I, I've got a book coming out soon. It's not out quite out yet, but it's called uh, How to Save, How to Cut Your Health Care Costs. Mm -hmm. And in it, I'm going to offer a lot of suggestions and tips for people who are struggling with how to pay for their medications, uh, you know, what to do when you get this humongous uh, hospital bill or bill from a doctor, uh, how, to, how to get supplies, that wheelchair or cane that you need uh, without spending a whole lot of money, and, and just and in general, uh, how to take better care of yourself so that you don't overspend your money. Um, you know, and, and I, I'm going to put in a lot of short tips do that because people just don't realize that there is a lot of ways to, to save money. Like a lot of people don't know that the uh, drug companies offer discounts on their medications through coupons. And if you take the time to go online, you can get those coupons from the site, from the uh, drug company website, mm -hmm. uh, and, and, and save yourself a bit of money. Mm -hmm. Or you can go with pharmacies when you go into the pharmacy you can get to some discounts for, uh, on some medications, but you have to ask for it mm -hmm. because pharmacists are obligated to volunteer. And most of them are busy working anyway, so they don't think about it. And, but if you ask for it, they'll tell you, oh, right. well, yeah, there's a discount on this medication. So, mm -hmm. you know, you just got to slow down a bit. And, and, and even when the doctor writes the prescription and you go to a pharmacy, I've had done this myself. Uh, and got there, and they said, it's going to be $700. And I said, are you talking to me or somebody behind me? Because I'm not going to pay for this. <laughs> and I told them to keep it. And I went back to my doctor, and I said, look, they want $700. i am not paying for that. Mm. And then she said, oh, I didn't know that. Because most physicians don't know what the cost of the medication is. Mm. I said, well, what do you do? She, uh, she said, oh, let me write something else. Mm. And the next one, was she wrote a different prescription, and it was covered by my insurance. And all mm. I had to do was pay the $30 copay. Mm. 
Right. And I told him to keep the seven hundred dollar medication. I'm not ever gonna buy that. Right. <laughs> so in fact she gave you a free sample from the uh, other uh, one. Yeah, know? well, you know, I'm a pharmacist and uh uh, you say, uh, yeah, yes, you, <laughs> forgot, you, you, for, you forgot that, huh? Yes, no, yeah, that's why I know, I know you're kidding. Uh, the uh, point is, is that uh, uh, when I was uh, first out of school, I was a pharmaceutical sales rep, and you're 100% right. Many times the uh, individual uh, salespeople are given a certain allowance to uh, be able to give out samples. Uh, now it's become uh, uh, more uh, paperwork than it used to be, but a doctor uh, can indeed uh, contact the pharmaceutical company on behalf of the patient, but it's that three-letter word that's magic that people are too embarrassed to do, which is ask. And anyone that's interested, uh, I'll be glad to give them some of the tips that I found helpful uh, by uh, giving out our toll-free number, 888-489-8980, 888-489-8980. And if anyone is uh, seriously interested, have them, they can call me, and uh, I'll be glad to give them some guidance on some of these, uh, uh, even the multiple chain-type stores, uh will provide certain antibiotics at no charge. And that's also sort of a hidden secret. Not that they purposely hide it, but everyone in the healthcare field, including in their regular everyday life, is so busy mm -hmm. that they forget to mention it. And I'm glad you brought it up, and I think it's a vital, vital part of the overall aspect of healthcare. And uh, just... Uh, as a simple guideline, many times people uh, develop new uh, ad adverse symptoms when the doctor puts them on a new drug, and they, uh, because of some of the side effects, they stop taking it without telling the doctor, which uh, is ridiculous because uh, when you come back for the following visit, the doctor assumes that if you're still taking it, that if it's not working, you should prescribe something else. Right. Only to find out that you didn't take the first one in the first place, or you can adjust the dosage with, you know, the pharmacist and doctor's approval, uh, because many times uh, the uh, full tablet uh, can actually uh, uh, cause a serious side effect, whereas if you broke the tablet in half, and there are professional right, little right. breakers, well, so all of a sudden you don't have to be a mathematical yeah, genius. You're, you're, you're stealing some of my tips. Oh, yeah, right. 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 <laughs> no, 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 we're sharing. Wait, no, no, sharing and stealing start with the same uh, okay. letter. <laughs> hey, well, that's I learned from a guy a long time ago. That's called research. <laughs> <laughs> you got it. You got it. You got it. You researched research. <laughs> <laughs> And the beautiful part about it is now is that uh, with the Internet, uh, you uh, can actually research the, from the same information that... Uh, your doctor does. Oh, and, uh, it's, it's amazing, amazing. People underestimate or not fully recognizing the, the, the potential mm -hmm. of what can be done to save money. Uh, and, mm -hmm. and I'm just scratching, mm -hmm. we're just scratching the surface here. Right. Uh, yeah. and, you know, I'm not, and like I said, we're talking medication here, but uh, which is a big issue for a lot of people. Right. Uh, but but, uh, it, but there, there's a lot of tips here. Too, and I'm trying to provide as much of it as I possibly can and and I will be done. The book will be out. Uh, I'm praying. I'm shooting for the, the end of end of April. Right. So uh, yeah. and, and I'm working. I've been I'm working on it every day. Right. Uh, well, and so we're uh, close. We're close. Yeah, no. Mm -hmm. Well, listen. Uh, yeah. Everyone has to have sort of a target date, and uh, uh, if you put some sort of a definitive uh, date on it, if you're shooting for the mm -hmm. uh, later part of April, by all means. Uh, Maybe by that time you might be in our fair city, Detroit, Michigan. Uh, <laughs> you know, that's, that's a very strong possibility. Yes, yes, well, yes. That's good. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was just going to ask, uh, if you have time, I was going to have you, uh, after we, we take a break, to talk about a book that you already have that we've 
Hype Town. A- accolades. Uh, accolades. Are you, uh, yes, are yes, you, are yes, you able yes. to stick around yes. for a while? Till, oh, absolutely. Uh, all absolutely. right, like so don't, so don't go away, do. and uh, we'll be right back with Dr. Andre Lee, who uh, has a phenomenal way for you to stay in touch with your remaining family, discussing what uh, I alluded to in the earlier segment, that uh, certain people in your life you want to remember the their attributes and all and you've never you didn't take the time to actually get their your thoughts together while they were alive the book is titled accolades very simple and it costs only eight bucks you can even if you're an organization use it as a fundraising and the subtitle of accolades by Dr. Andre Lee is celebrating the life and legacy of a lev- of a loved one before they leave. And right now we'll take a brief leave, but we'll be right back. So please don't go away, so we can talk with Dr. Andre Lee in Tennessee. <laughs> Bye. We'll be right back. <laughs> and uh, if you need a helping hand to stay at home. Or maybe you'd like somebody to provide transportation or grocery shopping or run errands for you. Uh, Or maybe you're going to need help with bathing or personal grooming. Or you need home renovations to enable you to stay in that home safely and securely. Or maybe you can't leave your home, but you need somebody to come in and do things like a doctor, a nurse, a podiatrist, a dentist, or Uh, to have your prescriptions delivered to you. Well, House Calls on Wheels is the answer to all of that. House Calls on Wheels provides both medical and non-medical services in your home. And all the medical services are covered by insurance. The non-medical services start as low as $10 an hour. So if you or someone you know needs a helping hand at home, Call House Calls on Wheels for a free in-home consultation. And that toll-free number is 1-888-489-8980. All right? That's 1-888-489-8980. And... uh... Since we're talking about your current home, as far as renovating, as uh, Bob Allison, who just did that uh, commercial spot, uh, alluded to, uh, if you're fortunate enough that you're mobile and all and do want to stay in your own home, we have a team of health care providers that uh, can give you the best spot in the world as far as your uh, surroundings, and that is your current home. But should you be in a situation where you just need more than your home can provide, uh, we uh, have got a complete program going with the area agencies on aging. There's 16 offices. It's uh, their nonprofit organizations. Our uh, uh, tax dollars have paid for them. So I work with the existing agencies to help you should you consider wanting to move and you are concerned about selling the home, packing your stuff, how you set up, uh, we'll be glad to help you. Just call our toll-free number, 888-489-8980. The good news today, unlike before, you never uh, had as many choices. There is independent living. There is uh, also assisted living residential facilities. There's what's called elder cottages where you can actually attach a separate living quarter right to your existing home and maybe have family members living in with you without getting in each other's way. All kinds of great options, and we stay within your budget. Just call us at 888-489-8980. And if you're more active and want to join us for a business-orientated group of people that feel that, hey, I don't want to just sit there at home or 
uh, actually just play bingo at senior centers, and they're great places. <laughs> but if you want to earn some extra income, join us for a free donut and coffee uh, connection Thursday morning, tomorrow morning, or every Thursday morning. Just call ahead. Uh, we meet at a level one bank at southeast corner of Big Beaver and Woodward. And we'd love to have you and assist you in having a home-based business. So you can make your home payments and also earn some extra income. And uh, an entrepreneur example is Dr. Andre Lee, who, as I mentioned, is in Tennessee. And he certainly hasn't just sat back in a rocking chair. I don't think, Dr. Andre Lee, you even own a rocking chair. Is that correct? No, sir. No, sir. I have no intention on finding one either. Look, look here. I, I always told my wife, look, when, when my time is up, I'm either going to be fall out on a racquetball court or, or they'll just, just find me slumped over my desk. And, uh, the man whipped right to the very end. <laughs> yeah, well, listen, uh, yeah, th uh, that's uh, the attitude I have. <laughs> the point is, is that uh, you might as well go out in style. <laughs> and mm -hmm. you start doing something that you like. Uh, but yep, uh, for, yep. yeah, but uh, for, on the practical standpoint, I thought... Uh, we'd uh, take a few minutes and talk about yeah, your great yeah, book, yeah, we'll Accolades. It's uh, really just a simple read, and uh, it's uh, only about 25 pages for $8. It gives you tips all the way from, in fact, uh, it's got like 51 tips, as I recall. And uh, how about simple stuff, like having a legacy book of writing down the uh, uh, actual uh, successes of someone that years close to you that is going on in years. And if you do it in this sub sort of a format, I don't think they'd be upset and at the same time probably happy to share some of their life experiences. And then I thought maybe you could address some of the other categories that you have in your book. Dr. Ackley, Ackley. Well, you, you know, it, yeah, it, and the, the whole idea behind the book was to, to not let the achievements of your loved one go unnoticed and to submit their legacy for years to come for the great-grandchildren and the great-great-grandchildren, you know, down the road. I mean, all of us want to be remembered for what we did and achieved during our lifetime, and that's what this does. Mm -hmm. And so I offer a, a range of tips. Uh, for people to consider easy things, easy things, and to do it while the people are still here. Right. Okay, you know, like you take a, a simple shadow box, and Hobby Lobby sells these things. You, you can put in that shadow box all of the important medals and certificates and awards that people have, have received, or pictures, as a, and, and as a highlight thing to hang on the wall for other family members to see long after that person is gone. Mm -hmm. But you put it there for them to see before they leave so that they know that, that this is the case. Mm -hmm. uh, another, one, another very simple tip is to buy seed cards and, and put those out, at, say, at the funeral, or before the funeral, really, but uh, to have to hand out seed cards and say, here, plant this, this flower bush in, in the name and record these perennials so that they'll come back every year in the name of this loved one, okay? Mm -hmm. That's a very simple thing to do, okay? Mm -hmm. and, and, uh, and, and I thought that would be something that people should, should do. Right. And then, of course, there's the personal journal. If the loved one is still lucid and able, have them write down their thoughts about their own personal thoughts and have that handy because they won't be here to express that later, but give them the opportunity to do it now, mm -hmm. again, for the, for the sake of the family right. and family legacy. Right. Yeah, that's just three simple tips. Yeah, right. And, and, all, right. Of, and all of that's in the book. There's, there's yeah, more there's in the 40, book. Yeah, there's like 48 uh, other ones as well. Yeah. And they're all yes. practical, not complicated type no. things. And uh, any organization that wants to use it, uh, I would think uh, churches uh, would uh, welcome that kind of an you know, opportunity. Yes. They can, yeah, uh, absolutely. We can, they can get a substantial discount, mm -hmm. and it retails for 8 bucks, and mm -hmm. the church... 
uh, can use the money for, you know, mm-hmm. especially with the wild weather we have in Michigan when it's snowing and you got a bad leaky roof. It ain't too pleasant mm-hmm. that day. Anyway, there's more to talk about. That's why I like to have you come on as frequently as you're available. And we'll look forward to our next visit with Dr. Andre Lee from Tennessee. But I can't leave this segment without my favorite parting thought, which is yesterday is history. Tomorrow is a mystery. Today is a gift. And that's why we call it the present. Please enjoy the present by looking and living life with the bright side of aging. Welcome to the Entrepreneur's Network Radio Show. Our mission is to interview successful entrepreneurs who are willing to share with us their ideas and experiences, both the successes and the failures. Because as it has been jokingly said, you should learn from the mistakes of others because you'll never live long enough to make them all yourself. My name is Ike Engelbaum, and I'm the founder of the Entrepreneurs Network of Michigan, which is a group of motivated people that are all interested in helping each other and achieving our personal and professional goals. Please check out our website, entrepreneursnetworkofmichigan.com, for meeting schedule as well as self-improvement material. Our philosophy is that if it's to be, it's up to me. His house calls on wheels. And uh, if you need a helping hand to stay at home, or maybe you'd like somebody to provide transportation or grocery shopping or run errands for you, Uh, or maybe you're going to need help with bathing or personal grooming, or you need home renovations to enable you to stay in that home safely and securely. Or maybe you can't leave your home, but you need somebody to come in and do things like a doctor, a nurse, a podiatrist, a dentist, or uh, to have your prescriptions delivered to you. Well, House Calls on Wheels is the answer to all of that. House Calls on Wheels provides both medical and non-medical services in your home. And all the medical services are covered by insurance. The non-medical services start as low as $10 an hour. So if you or someone you know needs a helping hand at home, call House Calls on Wheels for a free in-home consultation. And that toll-free number is one Triple eight four eighty nine eighty nine eighty. All right, that's one eight 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 four eight nine eight nine eight zero. Tune in every Wednesday at 11 a.m. for the Bright Side of Aging and the Entrepreneurs Network Radio Show featuring Ike Engelbaum. Ike does an array of interviews with people that make the aging process go smoothly. And for the Entrepreneurs Network segment, Ike interviews up-and-coming entrepreneurs. If you're looking to start your own business, Ike has some great advice to offer you to get your dreams of starting a home-based business a reality. If you'd like to talk to Ike Engelbaum for more information, call 313-929-6105. That's 313-929-6105. So tune in every Wednesday at 11 a.m. to hear Ike Engelbaum on the Bright Side of Aging and the Entrepreneur Network Radio Show. And we're back with you with a whole entrepreneurial spirit. And I'm really excited about having two new members of our Entrepreneurs Network of Michigan, uh, Dale Baydoon, Baydoon and Darnell Parker. Dale, did I pronounce your last name properly? You sure did. I. <laughs> okay, Thank good. You. Thank you. All right, thanks, God. And uh, if you want to see what good looking guys that are entrepreneurs look like, join us tomorrow morning or any Thursday morning from 9 15 to 10 30 at the Level One Bank which is at 37100 Woodward in Bloomfield Hills. 
uh, which is the southeast corner of Big Beaver and Woodward. We have a private area that we meet at uh, Level 1 Bank. And we, uh, as an added incentive, provide you free donuts and free coffee. It's free! <laughs> you can't beat that price, right? And if that wasn't enough, as they say, with the ginseng knives, there is more. Unfortunately, I don't have any ginseng knives to give out, but what I am willing to offer you is if you show up uh, and you want to have your voice heard on the Internet worldwide, on WCXI Radio, 1160 AM, or WNZK 690 AM. All you got to do is show up at our breakfast. Uh, it's actually uh, donuts and coffee, if you want to call that breakfast. They're healthy donuts, so I was told, but I don't want to be <laughs> recorded as saying that. But they're sweet, all right? And you got coffee, and it's free. You get a chance to meet entrepreneur-type people like uh, Daryl and Dale. And uh, also, uh, we usually take about uh, 10 to 15 minutes and discuss business-related uh, topics. As I like to say, if you uh, have the door prize drawing, just fill out a slip of paper, and if we pull your card, you get a 10-minute radio interview. So as I like to say, you can become almost famous and possibly rich. And I have a series of what I call Ikeisms, and uh, one of them is you don't have to be rich and famous to be happy. You just have to be rich. <laughs> so if you are looking to really live the American dream, it's like a lot of things in life. You can't do it as a Lone Ranger. As you know, even the Lone Ranger needed Tonto. And I'm not quite sure if uh, Dale Baydoon and Darnell Parker, if one of you is a Lone Ranger or not. Or <laughs> 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 but it's okay. You can decide afterward <laughs> as to who is who. And uh, uh, Dale uh, and uh, Baydoon and Darnell Parker are franchise owners for Lendio in Metro Detroit. And I'm always a firm believer that if uh, you get involved with any sort of company, uh, do, do not try to be a pioneer or a guinea pig. Uh, first of all, guinea pigs are not noted for having a long lifespan. Likewise in business, don't get involved with companies that just started last week or last month. Lendio was established in 2011, uh, which uh, especially, as you know, with all of the restrictions in our government system today, a good test of whether a company is legitimate or not is as to how long it's been established. And I would uh, venture to say if a company has been involved in a sensitive field as helping people get money, that you want to go with somebody who's got a track record that you can verify, indeed, they're, they're legitimate. And uh, Lendio Corporation is based out of Salt Lake City, Utah area, uh, but yeah, they're all over the map. Is that right, Dale, they, that uh, Lendio is covering pretty well most of the United States? That's correct, Ike, and uh, thank you for having us on your on your show. And uh, yes, Lendio, actually our corporate office is in the Salt Lake City, Utah area, but uh, we invested into the franchise territory here in Southeast Michigan in the Metro Detroit area. And uh, you know, we have several offices around the country. Uh, we're bringing that personal touch to, uh, you know, to, the, to the business. Right, well, you know, uh, there's nothing that beats, as I like to keep harping at our entrepreneur meeting is human being to human being connections. Uh, and uh, they say that uh, the key, if you want to lead a less stressful life, is that uh, figure out a way in life that you are being followed versus being chased. Absolutely. Okay? And when you get involved with I mean, the internet and all, a lot of people get all excited that uh, they are reaching the whole world. But meanwhile, if it's strictly online, 
it leaves a lot to be desired. So I wondered, uh, Dale, if uh, you could uh, uh, share with us, as you know, we have a 60-second elevator pitch. Uh, who is Lendio and what do they do? Well, thank you for asking, Ike. Uh, in a nutshell, Lendio is currently the largest online marketplace for small business loans. And basically, our passion is to fuel the American dream. Uh, we you know, bring numerous uh, small business financing options together in one place. Um, you know, we are partners with top lenders in the industry. We help small business owners shop the most business loan options available to them. And we do that through our, um, you know, Lendio Marketplace, and we do it for free. Uh, that's mm -hmm. uh, that's uh, the big part of it is uh, there's no cost to the small business owner to come to us. Uh, we currently have over 75 different lenders on our marketplace. Um, we offer over 15 different loan products. And, uh, you know, being part of the Lendio franchise here in Metro Detroit, my partner Darnell Parker, myself, and the sales team that we have um, are available to meet with people one-on-one -on -one to, to add that personal touch and kind of guide them through the process. Is that what you recommend, is that people call you and then you can set up a meeting at one of the offices throughout the, sti throughout the city? Yeah, we have multiple offices that we can meet at or we can guide them through the process over the phone if they can't meet with us. But we have multiple ways of doing it, but we'd love to meet people face-to-face -face and, mm -hmm. uh, and you know, establish a relationship that way. Uh, what phone number would you like to give out? Uh, I'd love to give out the phone number uh, for our office. Uh, is 833-695-3634. Once again, that's 833-695-3634. So then as far as the uh, process is concerned, uh, uh, can you do a preliminary evaluation by phone before you even set up a meeting? Absolutely. We're there to answer questions, and uh, this, you know, what we pride ourselves in is the simplicity of the process, Ike. Um, it's mm -hmm. one application that more than 75 lenders will end up seeing. We do not do a hard pull in the credit report. We actually pull a credit report and do what's called a soft pull, so it will not ding the person's credit in any way or have any uh, inquiries on the credit. And putting them in front of all these uh, different lenders will, uh, will allow them to get multiple offers on the different types of loans that, uh, that are in our marketplace. I have a very small mind, so please bear with me, but <laughs> I, uh, I am always fascinated by a company like uh, Lendio in that you've taken a concept that really has been around in the insurance business where you have an independent insurance agent who has various insurance companies that he represents. You get involved with uh, some of the major insurance companies and all their pitching is what they sell. Absolutely. What a brilliant, simple idea. You have 75 sources hey, this, and you know which one to put in touch with. Uh, would take years and uh, if you want to do it on your own uh, online, uh, sure, you get a bunch yeah. of names, but you don't know who's behind that phone. <laughs> exactly. And doing it online, you're going to go to each lender individually, spend days, if not weeks, sorting through the different lenders and programs. What we've done is we've uh, basically put everything in one uh, marketplace, mm -hmm. and we're there to guide you through the process. So, uh, Dale, uh, would you uh, say that that's your unique selling proposition? That is definitely our unique proposition. You know, we have all kinds of lenders from your traditional lenders. Uh, all the way to different alternative lenders. Besides making it simple, we just offer more options, Ike. Uh, we have mm -hmm. uh, programs that are uh, geared towards the traditional borrower, and we have programs that are geared more towards the alternative lending uh, products that are out there that uh, are less stringent and have re less requirements. Hmm. So uh, then, uh, can you share with me some of the different loan products that you have available? Absolutely. Some of the different loan products that uh, we offer on, through our marketplace would be uh, the gold standard for uh, business loans is SBA loans. So we definitely offer SBA loans, but we also offer different uh, loans such as commercial real estate loans, uh, term loans, lines of credit, equipment loans, cash flow loans, business credit cards, and several other options that are out there. Wow. Tell me uh, at our entrepreneur meetings, uh, people that come in and uh, are already in business, I see you have equipment loans. How does that work? That's actually one of our very unique programs. Uh, equipment financing, you know, most businesses have equipment and need to finance the equipment. So we have uh, options to either finance or lease the equipment. Uh, the beauty of our product is most of these uh, equipment loans require just an application only. And if you've been in business for over two years, we don't require any documentation. Mm. Um, as long as you're an established business for over two years, and uh, and you can uh, you know provide us with the with the application um, you know the the equipment is used as collateral and uh, and our lenders will fund it for you. Hmm. And uh, as far as 
The minimum and max, is there a minimum or max? So if you've been in operation less than two years, mm -hmm. uh, with regards to the minimum credit scores, that's a 680 score, but if you've been in business for over two years, we go down to a 600 credit score. Wow. And uh, Darnell Parker, I haven't had a chance to talk to you, so I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. We're gonna take a brief break, and then we'll get a chance to talk to Darnell Parker, who may be the Lone Ranger or Tonto <laughs> of the relationship. It all depends Dale on Bay the day. Dune. Okay, all right. Hi, oh, Silver. We'll be right back, folks. Don't you dare go away. <laughs> His house calls on wheels. And uh, if you need a helping hand to stay at home, or maybe you'd like somebody to provide transportation or grocery shopping or run errands for you, uh, or maybe you're going to need help with bathing or personal grooming, or you need home renovations to enable you to stay in that home safely and securely, or maybe you can't leave your home but you need somebody to come in and do things like a doctor, a nurse, a podiatrist, a dentist, or uh, to have your prescriptions delivered to you. Well, House Calls on Wheels is the answer to all of that. House Calls on Wheels provides both medical and non-medical services in your home. And all the medical services are covered by insurance. The non-medical services start as low as ten dollars an hour so if you or someone you know needs a helping hand at home call house calls on wheels for a free in-home consultation and that toll-free number is one triple eight four eighty nine eighty nine eighty all right that's one eight 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 four eight nine Eight nine eight zero, and just a friendly reminder, as I like to call it, tomorrow morning, Thursday, from nine fifteen to ten thirty. If you'd like to meet uh, two dynamic entrepreneurs that are in studio with me, you can see them live and in action. Uh, Dale Baydoon and Darnell Parker, who are franchisees of a. Uh, a really simple sounding uh, company called Lendio. Uh, they lend, uh, you lend money, and uh, since I keep talking about the Lone Ranger, hi -o, it's but it's, uh, it's only <laughs> I-O, Lendio. And uh, they'll be there tomorrow morning. It's free donuts and coffee, and you'll get a chance to get more information about something that is like the lifeblood of business, which is money. Without money, you can't get started in many cases. And uh, likewise, once you get started, it's amazing in your growth pattern, even though things are rolling along even better than you anticipated, guess what? You still need money to keep it going. It's uh, like, uh, I like to liken it to a car. Just because you fill up the tank doesn't mean that that tank's going to last forever. Eventually, you have to start replacing the stuff. And uh, the uh, uh, company is almost too good to be true. And I have a series of ICISMs. Uh, and uh, I take challenges on from different sayings. They say, if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is not true. Well, guess what? There are certain things that sound they're too good to be true, and they are true. And Darnell uh, Parker, you're in partners with Dale Baydoon, uh, and the big thing, the big deal that goes on is score credit, uh, how to restore the credit. And the sad part is, is uh, some of the uh, people that come to our entrepreneur network meetings uh, actually do not have that great a score credit and they want to get into business. So how does uh, uh, Lendio uh, make a difference in those people's lives? Well, Ike, score, as you may think, is not as important as a lot of people really think it is as far as in the business uh, world. Mm -hmm. uh, 
what we really look at is the strength of the business. That is the key factor. Now, there is some programs and products that we do offer that score will be a little bit more important, such as for the startups. Mm -hmm. But for the most part, credit is really irrelevant. We really are looking for the strength of the business. I mean, when you analyze it, isn't that the heart and soul of any entrepreneurial venture? <clears throat> The sad part is a lot of people that are entrepreneurs uh, are afraid to start a business because, well, no one else is doing this, and they they see it, but whoever they're talking to in the conventional loan business is not a visionary, as they like to be called. Is that correct? <laughs> that is correct. Well, you got to realize, in if the average uh, business entrepreneur is looking to do uh, – a loan to start up business, they go to a bank, more than likely the bank is going to decline you, or I should say approve two to three out of every ten, where we approve six out of seven. So we, we really remove that scare factor, especially when we're just looking at the strength of the business. So that's what really sets us apart. Well, in the notes that you gave me, uh, you actually do work with the SBA uh, loan programs, is that correct? Yes, we do. So it's not like they obviously wouldn't have you involved if they didn't feel your legitimate outfit. Is that correct? That is so <laughs> true. But we are also partnered up with uh, huge companies such as Comcast, uh, uh, Staples. Uh, in addition to that, we also have uh, one of our biggest lenders is American Express. So if we weren't legitimate uh, and uh, American Express wouldn't be on our team. Oh, absolutely. They... Uh, actually are very sensitive if you even tie in with their name. Exactly. Now, uh, we always hear about business loans and personal loans. What, uh, in your opinion, uh, are the differences between the two? Well, the biggest difference is that personal loans use credit score and personal income as the most important decision driver, whereas, again, we depend on strictly on guess what? your business mm -hmm. and the strength of it. And we also look at deposits. So if you're making a lot of deposits, therefore you're making a lot of money, or mm -hmm. at least you're generating a lot of money, uh, we should right. say. <laughs> right. Yeah, well, right. Well, uh, the uh, uh, thing is is that uh, from what I'm able to piece together, uh, which I'm very impressed with, is that uh, it's a known fact many times when you go to a bank, they not only are looking for you to have been in business for at least a couple of years and uh, do over a million dollars and what have you, your personal reputation is not as critical a factor in whether they get the money or not. And from what I gather from your notes is that you really go for the person. Is that correct? Correct. Like I said, uh, we really look at every type of business. We are an online marketplace. So we have every product that there is out there for every type of entrepreneur. Uh, as, as Dale shared with us, lending, uh, we have lending options such as lines of credit. We have uh, a couple lenders that will not even look at your credit score. We're looking at you. And uh, if you have a, a solid plan on what you're going to do with this money and a proven track record just on your bank statements alone, we can get you some money. Mm -hmm. uh, now, now, some products do look at other uh, uh, criteria. We look at time in business. We look at the deposits. So those are the type of things that we look at. But nothing, we're not going to ask for your firstborn or your kitchen sink or mm -hmm. three years tax returns. Well, no, we're going to get you the money so you can get back to doing what you do, and that is your business. And uh, you likewise put the strength on the character of the individual. Correct. Is that correct. Correct. So then, uh, as far as uh, the interest rates, I mean, uh, are they uh, off the top of the roof, or how, 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 what sort of a range is there? Well, they can range from anywhere from as low as five, six percent, all the way up to ten, fifteen percent. It all it really depends on the risk factor that uh, uh, mm. that's being conf uh, the lender is being confronted with. Mm. So. But let me tell you one thing, Ike. Mm -hmm. I personally don't sell interest rates. I sell return on investments. Mm -hmm. And the key is, if this money is going to allow you to put more money on your bottom line ongoing, then I say go for it. Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. And that's the key, return on investment. Well, uh, you hear that all the time, ROI, so then you operate the business for business. Exactly. (laughs) Uh, Is there a length of time that, uh, is there a time limit uh, when someone has a loan from uh, the, uh, your, your company, Glenda? Yeah. Well, we have products out there that range anywhere from one year, six, we, well, actually from six months, all the way up to five, ten-year products. We actually have some ten-year products. So mm-hmm. uh, it all depends on what's the best fit for your business. Mm-hmm. So let's say someone gets into a five-year type program. Okay. And they, on the fifth year, they just uh, they realize, hey, this is not going to work out. Is there a way of still continuing with uh, Lendio? Oh, definitely. If, it, and if you're talking about it's not going to work out, then they can definitely contact myself and Dale, and we can figure out the best option for them to get out of that product and get them into a product that works better for them. Mm-hmm. So if suddenly the business takes a wonderful turn for the best and uh, there's something better available, definitely. is, is there a penalty we, if they do this? Most of, most of our products do not have a prepayment penalty. We mm-hmm. can pay it off at any given time, and everything will be all right. Well, and uh, Dale, I didn't want you to sit there and fall asleep on me. <laughs> I'm here, Would Ike. You? I'm here. <laughs> That's good, because uh, I uh, uh, pride myself on keeping people awake while I'm talking to them. <laughs> so uh, as far uh, as far, you, you may have mentioned it uh, before, uh, this, if uh, they apply to Lendion, it's not going to affect their credits uh, in any way. Yeah, the way our process works, Sykes, it's very simple. With them applying on our platform, um, like I said, it doesn't uh, affect their credit immediately. Uh, what it does is it basically puts them in front of all the lenders on our marketplace. And if a lender's interested in them, they're going to make an offer to them. And at that point, from the proceed with the offer, that lender may at that time pull an actual full credit report. But the nice thing about it is they can shop the different loan products that we offer on our uh, platform before anything hits their credit. That you know, Because every credit pull is going to make your credit score go go down and we uh, we try to avoid that. Uh, Darnell, uh, obviously uh, we're dealing with paper and uh, just wondered what documents does someone need uh, to get a business loan? Well it all depends Ike. If you're going to a bank, like I said, you may have to give up three years tax returns, a financial statement, a debt schedule, your firstborn, maybe even your wife. I see. Well, maybe my w- <laughs> depending on the day of the week. <laughs> <laughs> that may be a good thing to do, right? No, but with Lindio, that is the good thing about us, and that sets us apart. We are an online marketplace, and with an online marketplace with Lindio, all you need is just an application and three months bank statements. Mm, well, I mean, and if you don't believe it, try us out. Yeah, well, listen, uh, there's no cost in meeting with you and finding out, and uh, if... For you to do an evaluation, how much time should someone set aside? Realistically, we can do about a half hour. That's all it really takes. Really? Yeah. That's incredible because, I mean, you're dealing with the lifeblood of a business, and uh, I've uh, run across so many entrepreneurs that they get to run around from bank to bank. If anyone is interested, of course, we have our toll-free safety number, 888-489-8980. And in your sexy-sounding voice, why don't you, uh, Dale, repeat your phone number twice. Go ahead. (laughs) That would be uh, 833-695-3634. One Once again, day. it's uh, 833-695-3634, Lundio Metro Detroit. Hey, we're my kind of guy, money guys, all right, because that's what entrepreneurship is all about, is being able to run a business profitably, and you are the lifeblood there. And I always like to leave this segment of my program with my favorite thought, which is, if you really want to get anything done in life, you'll find a way. And if you don't, you'll find an excuse. And there is no excuse for not achieving your dreams and goals in America because it is the greatest country in the whole world. Remember, a goal is just a dream over the deadline.
WNZK has available a few good hours of airtime for a few good programs to serve their communities. Radio is better than ever in targeting an audience that listens to what you say. Learn more about this exciting radio broadcasting opportunity by 